far away You seem so far away When it was only yesterday That you were so close to me Enough. Hey, what's poppin' YouTube? Come back with a quick video, man. Enoch Kill 777. Hope all is well. Shouts out to everybody out there. Y'all stay out the way. Say focus and balance. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. I just wanted to make a quick video and come out and let everybody know this, but the chosen ones, we do not fear death at all. And I know I'm not the only one that thought about this before. I know it's a lot of you out there that this done cross your mind a few times and you don't went back and forth you was like at the end of it bro i'm not afraid of death because something about spirituality and coming across all of this information bro especially within ancient kim in egypt bro like you learn so much of stuff about death bro you learn so much of freaking stuff about what comes after this simulation is over and once you come across just that information alone, I mean, if you believe in it, you feel me, um, it'll change like your whole perception on what you think about life, you know, because you'll start to see it as like a little video game or something like that. But um, death is definitely not it. And I know y'all heard and I know y'all heard this from a lot of other different people like they told y'all that you know energy never die and stuff like that i think there is like different levels and places which a soul can advance to after this life is over with so i do not technically think that everyone is on the same level but yeah if you go to the average person right now or you just know in general you know from going to like certain places like a, a funeral and stuff like that or whenever somebody bring a death you know and i'm sorry to bring this stuff up like i don't want to talk about this but you know something just told me to come out and make the youtube video because i wanted to put this out there and to let other people know out there that chosen ones we are not afraid of death and i'm not saying like literally like a uh if a person was to walk up to you right now and in the blank of eye boom you know stuff like that i'm not talking about that of course i'm talking about like in your subconscious this is something that always reappears and that comes to the front of your mind and you think about this constantly this has to be the number one thing that a lot of people actually think about so i mean all the bots out there bro like they think that you really only live one lifetime come on bro something gotta be up bro because I ain't no way everybody getting this far and you feel me like ain't nothing going on bro like something is most definitely happening and a lot of us here you feel me like we don't came back but yeah uh death is not the end and not only do y'all fear death so much but you also fear god so anytime i hear a christian or anybody say that they fear god I automatically, you know, knowing the information that we know and we take in on a daily basis, bro. So you telling me like y'all really fear us at the end of the day. That's why some of y'all be trembling. You feel me? And to keep your blood raw with you, bro, I swear to God, I walked in a store recently. And whenever I walked into this store, I ended up crossing paths with somebody that I used to know. And this is not the only person that do this. Whenever I come around, 
So I know this is taking place with you, but why do people tremble? So y'all afraid of God. So you telling me that y'all really afraid of us. But if I was to say, oh, you're afraid of me, you'd be like free. No, but I mean, something else have to know because you shake, you freaking shake every time we come around. You feel me? It's because of all of the energy. Delph is just temporary. You feel me? And basically what happened after this is you just go to a waiting place, you know, and you can be there how long you want and you can manifest and do what you want. But it's more freer. You know what I'm saying? Of course, with the dreams and stuff, it's more freer than this. But yeah, we do not fear death. And I wanted to make the video because with gang stalking, bro, it's a lot of people still trapped within the ego. They're not open minded yet. So they still let certain stuff get to them. Like they be crying and stuff with gang stalking. So when the demons and stuff be tormenting them and messing with them, you know what I'm saying? The whole thing is to make the chosen ones take themselves out. And this is the real reason why I'm making a video, bro. You feel me? Because that's the whole objective. You feel me? And I seen it first person. You know what I'm saying? I seen it first person. You know? You basically lose everything. You lose everything and then they got you down there and then they try to do everything they can to you and some more to take out that light, destroy that light. And then when there's nothing left, you feel me? They attack you, attack you, attack you. Okay, ultra and stuff like that. And then, you know what I'm saying? Psychological uh, war on your mind. Then some of y'all be crashing out, but... This is the number one reason, you feel me? It's a spiritual battle. But anyways, man, it's Enoch777. Peace, I'm out. Love, y'all. So